is I'm doing a video today on all our giveaway things we've been given mm. over on Instagram. We won a giveaway competition and i done a video on just some haul bits I got and then I decided to do a, oh yeah. a workout and like a what I eat in a day video. So it's like a big mixture of stuff in one but I just thought I'd put it all in one video because it'll probably only be like 15 minutes long instead of doing like loads of little couple minute ones. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoy my random, random video. There's no order as to what any of this is in, so I hope you enjoy. Hey guys, I'm just packing away the kids' washing. And before I quickly pack away these new bits, I thought I would show you. Um, hello, little man. I got the kids some new, they're like, I don't know, they're not summer bits, they're more like springy bits. Um, popped Primark and Tesco, and I thought I'd quickly show you them before I pack them away. Tesco at the minute have 25% off their baby bits, so I got Odin this one. This was meant to be £7, I think it was £5 something. I got him that in 12 to 18 months, so it looks quite big, but he's such a big boy, and um, that can be a bit oversized, but he had like no jackets like, to go over outfits to keep him like warm. And then I wanted to get him a coat, but I didn't want to get him like a thick winter puffer coat, because like even though we're still in winter because it's february like we're going to be coming out of it pretty quick um and it won't fit in for very long so i got him this one this was 12 pound but i said 25 percent off so i think this one was like nine ten pound can't remember i think it was nine something and it's got the really nice little hood on it and it's quilted and it's actually really thick um so this would be perfect up until like sort of springtime but it's so cute 12 to 18 months i got that one as well and yeah i think that was really sweet and then I, oh, I did actually buy myself something for once in my life. Um, <laughs> got myself some gym clothes. Not that I go to the gym. But Hello. I work at home. Hello. Yeah. Having a very crazy day at home. I got these in the mm -hmm. small. They're like some sort of cycling shorts, but I'll wear these just normally when it gets a bit warmer, obviously. But I'll wear them at home to work out with. And they were only five pound in Primark. And then I got myself this sports bra, which was five pound as well so ten pound for the gym outfit really cute one with the big jumper over that yes it's a melon and they are made out of a made using recycled plastic so go you primark so those those bits of me that's all i got there weren't really any like clothes things in there that i liked um i don't actually need anything um, and then I picked up Renee some bits because she's like that awkward size. She's in two to three at the minute, but she's some of it's getting a bit tight, like the tops and stuff. The leggings are just still baggy. I put her in some three to four leggings today and they're really baggy. It's a really awkward size. Um, but as you know, Primark come up quite small. So I got this jacket in four to five because I tried it on her in the shop. And this was only £3.80. Just a nice little zipper jacket just to like go over her clothes like when it's chilly and stuff. And on like chilly summer evenings, that'd be perfect. And then I got her these leggings. Oh, they are so cute. They've got like a little button on them and on the side. They were only £3.50. I did get them in three to four just because they're like that tighter material. But I think they are still going to be massive on her because she is quite dinks. Um, but hopefully it'll be all right. They're like ribbed as well. They're really cute. Then I got her some tops. This one I got in three to four. This one was £1.80. Really cute. Love that colour. That would just go nice with some leggings. Just like soft play days, casual days. And I've got her this long sleeve one. This one was £2.30. So their tops are really cheap in there. Oh, I did get that in three to four. And then she picked this one because she's really liking ballerinas at the minute. She wants to be a ballerina. This one was £2.30 as well. I've got melon juice on it, so I'm hoping it comes out. This was £2. It's got yeah. a rainbow one, it hasn't, Naya? Yeah. And it's really thick. I wish I got another one in like a size bigger. But yeah, it's really cute. This one's down to £2 in the sale. But I'm just, I really struggle getting watermelon out of clothes. So I don't even know if that's going to come out. Yeah. But hey ho. Um, yeah, thank you. <laughs> but yeah, those are all my little bits that I've bought from Primark and Tesco. I just thought I'd quickly show you because it's not enough to do an actual haul, but it's enough to quickly show you now. And excuse the state of me, Odin is still not sleeping very well, are you, little man? Um, but yeah, that's all my bits I've bought. 
very lucky are we this is our giveaway prize that we won on instagram I entered a giveaway um with at home with Liv. i'll leave her instagram and her youtube below and we've won this prize so we've got this little sort of coat um yeah. hanger haven't we naya yeah and i've got this one in the hallway we've got this little world map that's going to go amazing in odin's oh. bedroom because he has um like an animal room this little plant i might put in his room these I'm going to use for his book because he actually doesn't have a bookshelf and I was going to get him one. Then this that Renee is calling a hedgehog. It's so sweet. Um, the height chart, which I'm going to keep in the kitchen for them both. And she even put some command strips and a little note and a colouring thing for the kids. Oh, and a bunting. Like, we are so lucky and so grateful. So thank you so much at home with Liv and I'll leave everything below. <laughs> Here are the little giveaway things that we put up. They look so cute. This map is just honestly the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's like a um, fabric y material. And then Shane popped the little shelves up. This is going to be like his little reading corner. And then when he gets a bit bigger and he's got like his bed there, we could get like a little bean bag or something. Um, that's the bunting. And then I just popped his little dry fairy lights that used to be up there here. And I think they actually look better. Um, I didn't think they were going to go because they're like a navy colour, but they actually look really good. To open up his nap and I am going to do my workout. Renee is at preschool. I'm doing an upper body day today. Um, I was doing RWL, which is all like sort of structured workouts, but I'm kind of bored of like following some of them, just like winging it and just doing my own thing, um, which is quite nice as well. Um, so yeah. I listen to I will video a few things of what I'm going to do and then I will show you what I'm going to eat as well so enjoy watching me try and work out between nine and ten the kids get up at like half six and have their breakfast at seven but seven is just too early and I don't feel hungry and then if I eat breakfast that early I'm hungry by like 10 11 um this is what I used to happen like when I was pregnant and breastfeeding but I ate earlier because I was really hungry but now I'm not pregnant or breastfeeding I just literally eat when I actually feel hungry and I'm starting to feel quite hungry now um because I haven't eaten since seven o'clock last night um, so I'm going to make some healthy pancakes, this is what I usually eat if I've done like a workout or if I'm exercising that day I'm happier to eat like more filling things, if it's like a rest day I eat like sort of a lighter cereal like fruit and fibre or some fruit or just yeah something, yoghurt, whatever. Um, but yeah I'm going to make my healthy pancakes, I make them with porridge oats, banana, egg and literally like mash all that up, up and put a bit of milk in there like a drop and then on the top I pop on some protein yogurt this has got oh where is it 19 grams of protein per pot i use half of that and then i use half tomorrow with like some yogurt uh, this is yogurt some granola and then i put like a tiny bit of nutella on like each little bit of pancake i used to have like a massive scoop but i don't fry them in a bit of coconut oil because i find that's the best thing to fry them in um anything else doesn't work that i've tried um and then I pop some fruit on the top so i will try to show you how i make them <laughs>
anyone ever tells me that being healthy is boring, they are wrong. Or they're just doing it wrong. These pancakes are insane. Right, so we've been home from the preschool run for about half an hour and it's now half past one. Odin's really grumpy, he needs a nap. Um, I'm going to make myself a little pizza wrap once I've put them down. Um, I use one of these tomato puree, this, this. I've not actually tried this yet. My friend shared it on Instagram and I thought I'd give it a whirl. So yeah, this is going to be my lunch. This is our height chat that we got gifted as well on the giveaway. It's so cool. And they managed to put um, both the kids' names on it. I will tag the company from the Instagram on it. I'm just talking a bit now. Um, but yeah, and me and Naya are going to do some colouring, aren't we? That we got sent through the giveaway as well. And I'm going to have a cup of tea and a little fibre one popcorn bar as my afternoon snack. But mum, we had popcorn. No, we had popcorn yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, mm -hmm. we Want to do some colouring? I'm going to add a balloon. You can do the air balloon. Dinner tonight is smoked haddock. I normally have salmon every week, but I thought I'd try something different. I'm trying to eat more fish. and a little bit left of me. I've got some of these miniature potatoes because these are really nice. If you cut them in half and then put some of this, this, and salt and pepper on. And then I'm going to have some tender stem broccoli. The kids, I'm going to try it on this. Renee definitely won't eat this. Um, but Odin will kind of have the same with some carrots, but Renee will probably have like some chips. Or, no, she might have potatoes, some carrots and broccoli, and then she'll just have to have like a fish finger. She doesn't really eat any of it, to be honest, but hey-ho, worth a shot, and Shane will have a pizza. I have work tonight, half five till ten. I just do short shifts in the week, so this is my little snack that I take around with me because I'll usually want something when I get home in the evening, like I'll just crave something sweet. So if I take this with me, it'll prevent me even when I get back late tonight at 10. Um, and I always have to have something sweet after my dinner. So yeah, this will keep me going until tomorrow morning about 9, 10 a.m. when I eat again.